The elite women's race got underway under sunny skies in Chengdu. The first time a World Cup has been hosted in China since Beijing in 2007. Over 100,000 spectators turned out to watch a rich international field of elite women at the brand new venue built just for triathlon. The water temperature was a chilly 21.3 degrees and so it was a non-wetsuit swim, a welcome advantage for the stronger swimmers in the field. The Chinese team had four athletes in the top ten out of the water, with Margit Vanek of Hungary in a usual position among the top five after the 1500 metres. Wearing number one, Lisa Perterer of Austria exited the water some 30 seconds back and would end up in the chase back, as did Belgium's Claire Michel, whose first World Cup podium chances were in jeopardy early on. The lead group worked well over the 40 kilometres, putting time into the chasers on every lap. Meanwhile, two of the strongest runners in the field, Pertura and Michelle, were working hard to keep their medal hopes alive. Coming into transition, the leaders had put nearly two minutes into the chase group and were poised to steal a victory from the likes of Pertura and Michelle, who were yet to come off the bikes. Australians Gillian Backhouse and Tamsin Moana Vale established the lead early on, while American Jessica Broderick and New Zealand Simone Ackerman were not far behind. After five kilometres, Backhouse was in command of the race. Broderick, meanwhile, overtook Moana Vale for second place, but was not making up any time on the leader. Behind them, Michelle and Pertera were slowly reeling in athletes from the lead pack, but it was the Belgian who was having the run of the day, gaining some 20 seconds per lap on the leaders. Gillian Backhouse, though, would not be denied crossing the line for her first World Cup win by a comfortable margin. 29 seconds back, Jessica Broderick was ecstatic with her first World Cup medal. And with the run of the day, Claire Michel showed she'll be one to watch with a 35.09 run split to claim the bronze. I was just trying to stay calm and stay within my own race because I knew there were girls coming up on me. But if I tried to push the pace, I was going to risk absolutely blowing up and going back to almost a walking pace. So I was just like stick to my own pace and if they catch me then I'll try and go with them then. I'm having a mixture of emotions right now. I'm just really happy. It's been um, four months of hard work and uh, I'm, I was really excited to race and it's just like exceeding all my expectations so I'm really happy. Well I was a little disappointed with my swim. Um, kind of had a bad start, got off with a, a gap, had to push pretty hard in the chase group on the bike to, to try to keep that distance as, as minimal as possible and then had to <laughs> plow home on the run, give it everything I had to try to come back into it. But it's my first, it's my first podium for a World Cup, so I'm, I'm happy, I'm pleased with that. It's a step in the right direction, so I'm satisfied.